Hi friends, I'm so happy to see you again. Do you ever have times when maybe you feel kind of yucky inside or a little bit sad or maybe you just want to be alone for a little while? It's kind of hard right now, isn't it, when we're with our families 24 seven. Sometimes we just want to go and find a quiet place to be alone for a while. This is my favorite chair when I want to be alone. Sometimes I just sit in it to read a book. Sometimes I sit in it just to kind of think about things. And sometimes I like to just be here when I need some alone time like you do. If you don't have a favorite chair like this, maybe you have a favorite buddy like this teddy bear and you can go find a quiet place to be alone and, and just kind of snuggle with your teddy bear to make you feel better. When we're sad, when we feel yucky inside, sometimes the best thing is to know that we're not really alone and to remember that Jesus said he will always love us and he's with us. Even when we can't see him, he is always, always with us. And sometimes a little teddy bear or your favorite stuffed animal might be just like Jesus, holding you tight and making you feel better. I want to read a book to you today called Jesus Wants Me for a Sunbeam. Do you know what a sunbeam is? A sunbeam is that ray of light that comes from the sun. And on a beautiful day like today, those sunbeams come right in through our windows. They make the flowers look all bright and beautiful. And sometimes they fill up our whole room with light. And Jesus is like a sunbeam in our hearts. Sometimes he fills up our hearts with light when we're feeling sad or yucky inside. And when the book says, about a little duckling that Jesus wants me for a sunbeam, I think what it means is that Jesus wants each of us to be like a sunbeam to everybody else to make them feel loved and like they're never alone. So let's read our book. Jesus wants me for a sunbeam to shine for him each day in every way to try to please him at home, at school, at play. A sunbeam, a sunbeam. Jesus wants me for a sunbeam. A sunbeam, a sunbeam. I'll be a sunbeam for him. Jesus wants me to be loving and kind to all I see. You might not be able to see it, but the little turtles caught his leg in a piece of grass, and the little sunbeam chick is going to come along and help untangle it for him. Showing how friendly and happy his little one can be. Everybody's happy now. I'll be a sunbeam for Jesus. It's easy if I try. Serving him moment to moment, then live with him on high. Jesus wants me for a sunbeam. I'll be a sunbeam for him. And friends, what I want you to know is how much I miss you and how when I see you, you're like Jesus' sunbeam for me. Just seeing your faces and your smiles and, and getting your hugs makes my heart light up with love. And I thank you for that. So I want to sing you a little song just for you. It's not about sunbeams, but it's about sunshine. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. 
I hope that every day you'll try to be Jesus' sunbeam for somebody and that when you're scared or sad or lonely or afraid, that you can find some place to go and snuggle up with a buddy. Remember that Jesus loves you and that I love you too. I can't wait to see you again. I love you so much. Until the next time, mwah!